The next day, Green's housemates came to the police station to talk. Despite the threat, Carlton Carey and his wife wanted to help. His wife was interviewed in a separate room at the station. Yeah. Carey said that he and Green had embraced the temple until recently when its leader, Hulon Mitchell, started calling himself the true messiah. The charismatic leader of the temple, Hulon Mitchell, believed that blacks were descended from the lost Hebrew tribe of Judah. As followers of Mitchell, members abandoned their given names. They took a biblical first name and adopted the last name of Israel. Mitchell did not allow dissent among his followers. Mitchell eventually changed his name to Yahweh ben Yahweh, which means God, son of God. In fact, during the uh, interview we had with him, he referred to Hulan as not the Messiah, but a crook and a swindler, which was his characterization of Hulan Mitchell at that time. Kerry still had reservations about talking to police. Detectives offered to escort him home. He declined, opting to leave with his wife alone. When they left the homicide office that night, they didn't want to be escorted because any police being with them would be further uh, attraction to anybody that saw them, and they were concerned about being seen with anybody. Uh, they didn't want us to escort them home. Carrie and his wife took a winding route home to make sure no one had followed them. suspected someone to be waiting inside. <laughs>